Hey guys, Token Vaping. Uh, thank you for joining me and checking out this review. It is the final flavor in a line that I have been working extensively with. Um, if you have been watching my past reviews on this company, then you do know uh, a little bit about them and uh, their flavor line and the flavors up to this point. Now, the one that I saved for last is mainly because it's one of my more favorite flavors that, uh, that I vape on a regular, so it's definitely one I wanted to try, but I figured if I if I saved it to last, it would, it's kind of like a, um, a, a build up to like dun 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 type thing. So without further ado, I'm gonna jump right into it, but it is the Doc Cheatham uh, Old Fashioned Line uh, Company's Midway Vapors. This is Gianna's Strawberry Milkshake, and that is the look of that. Now this basically is supposed to taste like a old fashioned, you know, true uh, milkshake, basically just taking uh, fresh strawberries, ice cream, throwing them in the blender, whipping it up and just having a strawberry creamy goodness out of this. So we're definitely going to jump into this. As always, it will be going on fresh cotton, as I, I show right there, as I always try to do. Texas tough. It's the tough wicks. Um, it's just cotton that I use you know, as, as often as possible. I've just I've been a big fan of the product. I use it, you know, pretty much in anything that uh, that I work on. It's been the basis for all my uh, taste testing, um, stuff like that. But that link is, uh, the web address is always going to be in the box below since YouTube, I believe, is trying to prevent uh, actual link links. Um, but it's also next to that subscribe button. So if you like uh, what I'm doing. If you want to see more, go ahead, just give me a like or give me a subscribe. Um, so we're going to jump right into this one right now. And I'm really excited for this flavor, truthfully. Definitely, it definitely gives off that a, a sweet strawberry smell and not in a candy form, which I'm actually is a very good sign because the last thing you want really when it says a milkshake or cream or anything like that is for it to have a really strong candy style odor because that's not the type of sweetness or um, flavor profile that you're under the impression that you're supposed to be getting off of this. So we're definitely on the right path with that. I'm just gonna go ahead and get this wicked up here and hopefully we will be a-okay and we will hit nothing but flavor nirvana on this now like i said normally i go with like a custard a cream a cheesecake but strawberry is all for whatever reason has always been the flavor that i've always leaned towards um and it's just always been the one that i've enjoyed the most so anytime i see you know a strawberry milkshake a strawberry milk a strawberry cream a strawberry custard a strawberry cheesecake a strawberry pretty much anything except candy I automatically have to in my head. I tell myself I have to try that flavor. Doesn't matter what the what the, what the profile is on it, as long as it's basically within uh, that guideline, so to speak. It pretty much. Sorry, excuse me one second. I dropped my cover. Um, it's basically what draws me to that flavor. So I'm definitely, definitely. I can say pretty surely that I have tried, you know, a few, two, three, four dozen types of um, flavors in that range so it's definitely something that I found I enjoy a lot wasn't sure that I would I but you know vapors we all have a wide range of flavor preferences and um, taste palettes so that's what makes this really really enjoyable when you have a lot of different options my point and my purpose is I'm just trying to help you find them so without further ado, since I've babbled your ear off, thank you for listening to that. I'm gonna go ahead and pop my top cap on. We're gonna definitely try this out. So this is Gianna's Strawberry Milkshake uh, from Doc Cheatham's Old Fashioned Line from Midway Vapors. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick redrip as I try to always do. And that's mainly just because it was fresh cotton. So I wanna make sure that I'm not missing anything on the flavor um, that is supposed to be there or in the same argument that I'm not getting too much of something that normally shouldn't be as heavy or strong in the flavor because it is 
uh, new cotton and all of that. So just bear with me here a second. I'm just gonna get that pop back on, do a couple of more, a couple of quick vapes, and I'll give you my opinion. Okay, so, new favorite, and I will now actually stand by this one, but definitely new favorite of this line, Gianna Strawberry Milkshake. You definitely taste strawberry on the inhale, you definitely have strawberry on the, on the, uh, the undertone of this, but it is not overpowering, it is not, like I said, it is not a candy, it is not overly sweet. Basically, it has a very smooth, a nice, fresh strawberry style flavor. Now, speaking of smooth, the milkshake ice cream aspect of this definitely kicks in almost immediately after you take that inhale. And it is, it is nothing but smooth. It basically, I mean, if you've ever had a strawberry milkshake after the, the initial coldness of it, you know, abates and it starts to warm up a slight bit so that you're getting like when you, as you're drinking, you're not trying to suck really hard through the straw for it, but as it's flowing through the straw, that mix of strawberry and ice cream as it hits your tongue is basically what you're going to get out of this flavor. Now, the little surprise about this that I was not expecting and I really do like, whenever you get to the bottom of or the end of a strawberry milkshake, you have those little bits of strawberry after they've been sitting in the ice cream, so they have like a really uh, like a creamier, smoother flavor on it, but you still get like that strawberry, like the little bits of strawberry on the back of your tongue. The ending, the ending of this, of this vape, the exhale, as soon as you exhale it on the back of my tongue, I definitely taste that, which I don't know if that was intended, whether it was or not. That's a great little surprise because it's just an added little flavor kick that just kind of pops it and it's just like, oh, I really enjoyed this flavor anyway, but that just made it, you know, that much better. Yep, definitely there. Definitely enjoyable. Being a milkshake, it's not super heavy, so this is definitely something you could vape all day, um, especially if it's a warm day, just vaping the milkshake, getting that flavor to hit your tongue. It definitely will give your body that enjoyment of having a milkshake, you know, when you're going down on a, on a summer day and you go down to the ice cream shop and you, you get a strawberry milkshake. This is kind of reminiscent of that flavor-wise. So definitely, a, definitely a, a home run with this one. Definitely something that I'm pretty sure this bottle will not look like this in the next day or two. So hats off for that. As always, these are a 75-25 mix. They are available in a 0, 3, and a 6, and they are 60 ml bottles. You can uh, purchase these from myvapebar.com. Um, just check out uh, Doc Cheatham's uh, Instagram page if you have any questions or anything on that. It will t it, there is a link for um, the flavor profiles and things like that, but it's also posted on various pictures in that page. The other really great thing about this, and I, I'm don't want to take up too much more of you guys' time. Thank you for watching again, as always, but I just want to take a moment and um, touch base real quick on another aspect of this company, which makes this so great. Proceeds of every sale, and as I've said before, you don't have to buy them in bulk. You don't have to buy them, you know, in a large quantity. Um, you can be a single person who, or, you know, a single customer who just buys one bottle, whether it's one bottle, 10 bottles, 20 bottles, 50 bottles. A proceed of every bottle sale goes to a, an amazing foundation charity called Gianna's Voice. And what that is, is it is a uh, foundation that is trying to spread the word, the teachings, the understandings, the clarifications, and awareness, more importantly than a lot of, a lot of the other things, about the prevention of teenage suicide. It is an epidemic that is actually a serious issue in this country, actually all over the world. Um, I feel it's something that <clears throat> a lot of people don't wanna deal with or don't want to admit or face that actually happens, especially those that have actually lost, uh, whether it's their own children, relatives, um, 
things like that to something of this this serious nature. Uh, speaking of that, for the milkshake, if anybody has been wondering where the name came from, Gianna was somebody who was very, very close to the people behind uh, Midway Vapors and the Doc Cheatham line. She was very important to them. She was very uh, in, in touch with everything about this. She basically was the inspiration for this flavor. Um, she also was a, a very huge proponent in the fight for the awareness of teenage suicide. Um, unfortunately, she uh, ended up having to join the the Table of Angels, and she now sits and watches over everybody at the company and lets them know that they're still um, they're still looked out for, they're still taken care of um, emotionally, supportively, and everything else like that. But they continue fighting the with with this awareness and this charity in her name in honor of her. So beyond just the fact as I, like i've stated before beyond just the simple fact that you're getting you know some great flavors that are definitely going to hold up well and you're going to enjoy you're also helping support and promote a foundation charity that is trying to basically get the unawareness out there for an epidemic that you know a lot of people don't want to realize does truly exist to the scale that it does so you know i've stated it in a, in a few of the other videos me myself personally i can't think of a greater win-win situation than something like this to where not only are you benefiting it yourself and you're getting a great product but you're also benefiting from helping society and helping promote uh, a really great cause so either way it's definitely a positive it's a great it's a great everything all around for everybody so definitely go uh, go ahead and order yourself a bottle what like i said whether it's one five ten fifteen twenty does not matter you are helping out either way across the board. Gianna, I thank you. I didn't have the honor or pleasure of having met you, but thank you for being the inspiration for an amazing flavor. Thank you for showing us to how to continue fighting and, and promoting this, uh, this cause to help further um, awareness for, uh, for the prevention of um, teenage suicide and helping it get the recognition that it needs so that it can get the help and support that it deserves. So until next time, guys, thank you so much for watching. As always, I will always be here doing as many reviews as possible to help you guys find that flavor that hits your palate and becomes your next all-day vape. As always, always truly love yourself. Keep it cloudy.